as promised uh, with some more of Queen's Wednesday on Y in the morning. My name is Barry Moses or it's Barry Moon social media. So remember, uh, we, you, can, uh, you can interact with us as well on the family social media uh, platforms, which are always right there below the screen. Uh, the place to focus on today is Facebook and Twitter. Our Facebook is Y254. Our Twitter is Y254 channel. And the question we're asking today, what are some of the extremes uh, people go uh, during uh, or after breakups? in terms of reaction and we have a picture there that is self-explanatory i'd like to sample uh, some of the comments that you have sent away uh, so g jimenez santos and asema uh, if those were my credentials then i would caught for mad wow okay princess k and asema and russia juja tuned about the topic i think it's all about mature thoughts i thought you could react to the it's part of the journey to find your soulmate so she believes uh kwachana nam to opens up the opportunity for you to meet your soulmate if it wasn't meant to be then it wasn't meant to be thank you very much for that one and then we have <coughs> Lucky boy keep chumba na sema hii uh, ni lucky keep chumba from Eldoret una break up na mtu then uh, ukim text kesho anakuuliza ati ni nani na najua <laughs> I love this one. Thank you very much for that one. Felix Werner said, I can't waste half of my life looking for papers for you to tear them and walk scot free. I don't know what I will do to you, but I'm sure I will do it. Mm -hmm. So the picture has caused a lot of, uh, it has provoked a lot of um, uh, thinking and a lot of comments right here. Uh, Sydney Skid K. Yana said, Just go Bila uh, Grudge after sorting everything out. Just in peace. Akuna ngore. Okay, Richie Webb and Asema, I've never seen men do this kind of stuff. So it's trying to insinuate that it must be a woman who did this thing that we have in the picture right there. If you're not getting what we're talking about, head straight to our Facebook page. That is at y 254 You'll see it uh, pinned right there. Uh, the question is there and a the picture uh, to guide you uh, towards what we are saying. Fidel, the baby from Kasabuni and Sama Wengine, our jury after breakup. Wengine ha ujiwa after breakup, which is the worst case scenario ever. Wengine kujiwa after breakups. Aitaki Asira. Always remember Aitaki Asira. Okay, Samuel Lazena nasema yuo yuo hatari sana men alafu naomba mcheze video yangu please uh, we're going to sample it and then if it's clean definitely we're going to play it vini shampeke ya nasema sijai funga mlango uh, kijisikia a token is sour i don't force hajawai kufunga mlango with joe nasema wa hiyo ni noma me uh, in ramba niliitishwa hadi sok uh, alikuwa amebaye za white haha ha, sita wa sawa alitishwa hadi socks wakati wa break up all right gidraf uh, gidra hope guy anasema punchline king uh, wengine hadi uchoma nguo which is a very <laughs> Which is something I've seen. All right, Beda Slay and my insults. Uh, much are well represented. Beda Slay always watching wine in the morning. Odiambo Ayuyo Anasema. Aha. And I say that no one should admit that they can't kill. Wow. That is a deep one right there. Thank you very much for taking your time to comment. And uh, we appreciate everybody who takes their time to interact with us on our Facebook page right there. Uh, keep them coming. If you have any story to share with us, we'll really appreciate it. On to our first interview of the day now. And this brother right here. His name is Tony Mumo and he's a young entrepreneur and is the CEO and founder of Mark Me. And now they have a new product in the market that is here to share with us. Karibu sana, Mr. Uh, Mr. Tony. Asante sana. Thank you for the chance to, to talk. All right, all yeah, right. Yeah. Uh, your camera is number four right there. Okay. Just introduce yourself in case I forgot something. Uh, uh -huh. You can add it. Pali kwa credentials. Oh, so so uh, my name is Tony Mumo. Mm -hmm. I'm an entrepreneur. I'm the founder and CEO of Mark Me. Uh -huh. So we recently launched an e-learning product as we are attempting to rebrand what we are doing and to create more value for people. Mm -hmm. uh, so the e-learning product is called Shuffle Learn, mm -hmm. and I'm really thankful to get the chance to showcase it uh -huh. and show how good it is and uh, the value that it can add um, to people. All right. So Shuffle Learn is the latest product that you have right here. Yes. And uh, 
I'm loving it. I'm already on the website right here. And uh, at home, I see uh, we have a number of things. We have a number of buttons that we can click right here. There's home, there's land, there's shuffle talk, there's mm -hmm. SL store, and then there's about. So when I click here at about, I can learn everything about uh, shuffle land. But I'd like yes. to get it from you. Yes. Uh, why the name shuffle land first? Um, so shuffle land is based on the identity of the product. Mm -hmm. So it's a card based uh, e learning platform uh -huh. where you get to shuffle through cards in order to learn. Uh -huh. So it's a very simplified method of learning. Mm -hmm. We don't give you a lot of articles or uh -huh. a lot of paragraphs to uh -huh. read. It's very fun and engaging. Uh -huh. And as you are shuffling through the cards, uh -huh. uh, we thought that would be a really good name to uh -huh. give the uh, product its identity. Uh -huh. So the name shuffle learn is based on what you are doing on the uh -huh. website which is learning by shuffling cards uh -huh. so it's uh, it's just as simple as so as, the as whole that. concept is learning by sh from shuffling cards yes, so you have yes. key pointers that you can read uh, as you shuffle them cards yes yes all right yes. Uh, i hope we can uh, get the website on screen right here because uh, i have it right here so uh, mm -hmm. when did you come up with this idea mm -hmm. uh, being uh, your background is mm -hmm. uh, mass communication yes so. yes yes mm -hmm. uh, yes so uh, my background is in film that's mm -hmm. what i studied mm -hmm. uh, i studied film because i started with youtube that was my first um outlet for my creativity mm -hmm. um so but i wasn't uh, truly satisfied with with film and video mm -hmm. i didn't feel like it's the threshold or uh -huh. it's the limit of what i can create uh -huh. Uh -huh. so i started learning um html uh -huh. uh, through a site called code academy uh -huh. I also learned to use developer tools mm -hmm. uh, through sites like Wix mm -hmm. and mm -hmm. combining um, that knowledge mm -hmm. is how uh, we were able to come up with uh, the idea for ShuffleLearn. Uh -huh. But I also love e-learning products uh -huh. and I haven't found... So you're a product yes. of uh, e-learning because yes. Code Academy is an online learning platform. Yes, yes. Uh, that's how you learn to code. Yes. Uh, so you figured, oh, since I can learn like this, I can also help uh, other people to learn uh, yes. in the 254 and worldwide. Yes. All right, so mark me. How many people do you have at Makni as, uh, mm -hmm. uh, as uh, the people that you work with? Um, currently, I have a team of five people. Uh -huh. um, so all of them are my close friends. Uh -huh. um, two of them we met in primary school. Uh -huh. uh, that, that, that is way, way back. Way yeah, back, way uh -huh. back, yes. Uh, so three of them, I met them in Kenya Institute of Mass uh -huh. Communication. Uh -huh. So they are a really talented group of uh -huh. people and I, we wouldn't be able to have that product without uh -huh. their ideas, so their output. The Yes, uh, a shout out to everyone at Mark Me. Uh -huh. Yes, for helping uh, with what you're doing. Just uh, mention names. Just five um, names. To Tony Bryan, uh -huh. to Dickens Kingori, uh -huh. Cedric, and uh -huh. Kate. Thank you for your efforts to build Shuffleland and Mark Me. All right, Kate is the yeah. only lady in the group. Yes, yes. So you have not reached the two thirds. Uh, the one third gender rule. Yes, <laughs> at, yes, at uh, yes, yes. Right. yes. Okay. <laughs> I yeah. hope you reach yeah. the one third gender yeah. rule right now. Yeah. But anyway, uh, so we have uh, the the shuffle talk here. Yes. It's called shuffle, huh? Yes. But we have a button here. Uh, shuffle talk let me click on it yes. tell me more about this shuffle talk what happens at shuffle talk um so the basis of the product is mm -hmm. to allow people to create and mm -hmm. access topics as well mm -hmm. so i can join shuffle learn as a topic creator if mm -hmm. what i do is photography mm -hmm. i can join as a photography topic creator mm -hmm. and create those topics mm -hmm. so the essence of shuffle talk uh -huh. is to allow a direct line of uh, communication publicly uh -huh. Uh -huh. between the topic creators and the learners all right so, yes. so i can i can i can do my research uh -huh. i have a I have a document uh -huh. on something i researched uh -huh. and put it on shuffle talk uh -huh. and then engage other people in the same field uh -huh. yes yes on this particular topic that i did my research on yes yes Okay, that is amazing right there. Yes. Okay, so what are some of the uh, the fields that people uh, can study mm -hmm. uh, in here at Shuffle Learn? 
as we speak. Uh -huh. um, so as we started Shuffleland, uh, we wanted to base uh, the first round of topics around four categories mm -hmm. that would uh, capture people. So mm -hmm. from the research that we did, mm -hmm. the best categories to start with were business, mm -hmm. well-being, uh, content creation, and mm -hmm. planning. Mm -hmm. So those are currently the four uh, topics, uh, categories that uh, are so available. Things that are affecting this generation right yes, now. Yes, yes, yes. People are obsessed with content creation. People want to create content and yes, upload. Yes. Uh, it's a source of income as well. Yes. Uh, well-being is, is, uh, is a major issue right now. Yes. We have a lot of uh, mental... Uh, I don't want to call them illnesses, uh, me mental health issues. We yes. have a lot of mental health issues as well. And then we have photography. Photography is buzzing right now. Everybody mm -hmm. has a camera. Yeah. Everybody with a smartphone has a camera. Yeah. So these are some of the things uh, you're helping people to learn right here. Yes. All right. Uh, when it comes to the original content that you have here, mm -hmm. uh, how do you manage to license them? Mm -hmm. uh -huh. Or is it original content created by people mm -hmm. uh, from uh, Shuffleland? Um, as a team, we come up with our own topics so that we wanted to start with uh, first providing our content as Shuffle and team. So in terms of licensing, we don't uh, plagiarize content, it's uh -huh. our own. Uh -huh. So we research and then we come up with our own content. Uh -huh. But as for topic creators, uh -huh. there are it's terms, open. yes, there are terms and conditions. So uh -huh. like what you post on Shuffle and you own it, we uh -huh. don't own what you come to to post on our uh -huh. on, on our platform, platform. Uh -huh. yes you have the rights if you want us to take it down you can just contact us easily and we will we will do that mm -hmm. but in terms of licensing we haven't reached um, that point of mm -hmm. uh, all right all right buying content topics. from other people yes. uh, mm -hmm. so it's an open field you mm -hmm. have your own content as shuffle and mm -hmm. then it's open for the what did you call them? topic creators topic creators you have room for the topic creators yes. to come upload their stuff yes. and people can have conversations around them yes yes wonderful right there yeah. so uh i see it's a it's an amazing site even the outlook the interface right there mm -hmm. uh Shuffleland is a new e-learning platform that believes in innovating learning uh, by creating uh, a fun, unique, and engaging learning system. Explore Shuffle fun uh, of the day uh, and and learn about us. Simply click uh, whatnot and whatnot and whatnot. Yes. All right. Yes. Uh, so uh, there's so many aspects that go into this. Mm -hmm. We have the coding, the back-end coding. Mm -hmm. uh, we have uh, creating the user interface, the graphics. Mm -hmm. We have the legal aspect that you were telling me about. Mm -hmm. uh, we have the corporate aspect. Mm -hmm. uh, how, uh, who does all these things? Mm -hmm. all Everybody has specialized among the five people that you told me about. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes, everyone plays a role in, in making it. Mm -hmm. But currently, I'm the one handling the development side of, mm -hmm. the, of the website. Uh -huh. um, so in terms of user interface, mm -hmm. I wanted to build something that would be easy to use. Because uh -huh. uh, uh, I think even for me as the first user as I am building it, uh -huh. if it doesn't satisfy my mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. need for user friendliness, then uh -huh. I'll feel there's something wrong with uh -huh, uh -huh. with the product but uh, we've built it to be very simple uh -huh. and as you can see even from the home page uh -huh. uh, we're telling you to simply click left or, or right uh -huh. uh, from that simple exercise you have mastered what the platform is about you simply uh -huh. click left or right to shuffle and learn and I like, I like the transition yes uh -huh. yes yes so yes in terms of the I think you asked about the corporate end uh -huh. yes, uh, yes. different aspects I just want mm -hmm. to know uh, if one person does all these things mm -hmm. or people have the or have specialized um, I do the content, uh, uh, I do the developing, mm -hmm. uh, so my team handles the content in terms of, like we have topics about long-term planning, personal uh -huh. development planning, so I delegate those tasks to them to create uh -huh. the topics. Uh -huh. We have a lead designer uh -huh. uh, called Ndwiga, so he came up with the logo uh -huh. and the branding of the... Uh -huh. of Which the, I love so much. Yes, yes, uh, he's, a, he's a brilliant, brilliant the designer. The is subtle, but you can still tell. Yes, yes, uh -huh. he's a brilliant 
brilliant designer so he handles the the design of of the of the cards as well mm -hmm. for the shuffle cards as you can see they have a design so that is also in Riga's, mm -hmm. Riga's work in terms of the photos there we have uh, Tony Bryan mm -hmm. so he does the photo decisions in terms of what matches uh -huh. what goes the topic. on what doesn't go on yes and yes, whatnot. yes right and then you oversee the whole thing you yes, the whole thing yes all right so as a CEO what are some of the challenges mm -hmm. uh, that you have faced uh, as a uh, as a as a starter mm -hmm. in the two five four mm -hmm. Um, I think definitely the first challenge is financing. Uh -huh. uh, you know, Shufflelearn is a product that needs major investment in order yes. to, to actually get you need somewhere. A lot of content. Yes, you also need a lot of marketing uh -huh. costs. So the first major problem is uh -huh. is, is financing, but uh -huh. that that doesn't hinder us from from putting Doing our product you, uh, out there. Uh -huh. You know, but I believe in divine connections. I believe there's always someone who will uh -huh. see what you're doing and they will believe in it enough to share the vision. To help you. Share the vision. Right? Yes, yeah. Uh -huh. So that is currently something that we need uh -huh. right now. If there's any investor or partner right. who would be oh, willing to help. If you're looking help. out uh, for, yeah. uh, to call investors, just look them straight into the eyes right okay. there and talk to them, the uh, potential investors. On camera four? Yes, on camera four. Um, uh, hello, uh, if you are an investor or uh, or an, an angel investor or a partner who can help us with uh, seed capital to to further push our product, we would be very interested in, in, in talking to you. You can talk to us at Mark Me's page or you can send us an email. Uh, my email address is itonimumo at gmail.com. So if you'd like to join us and be a part of our team, we would be very much willing to have you to take shuffle and to where it's supposed to be. All right. Yeah. Thank you very much for that one. Uh, so uh, the, the the innovation space in Kenya right now. Mm -hmm. Are you interacting with other innovators? Yes, in terms of my, I think my close, uh, your close circle, circle of uh, friends to uh, see what they are coming up with, especially people who are also doing uh, uh, things with websites and uh, programming and that coding end. That's mm -hmm. something that really interests me and I would love to add on you know, people who can do AI coding uh, uh, that is really advanced for, that is the future, for right? me. Uh -huh. Yes, yes, if we could have such technology in the website that learns what topics you like in order to just suggest oh, right, to you right, the right, right. So those are, topics. Those are some of the things you're going to be focusing uh, in the future yes. uh, at Shuffle Learn right here. Yeah. All right, we have had a pan pandemic the last seven months, I think, mm -hmm. and people have learned new things uh, that they didn't even know uh, existed. Mm -hmm. How has Corona uh, affected uh, you as a as somebody in the startup space? Mm -hmm. I think the first thing I can say is, uh, for so for Mark, in order to get to where we are, we were surviving on small uh, opportunities like photo shoots or maybe doing a video for a salon. Mm -hmm. So such small opportunities really became hard to mm -hmm. to, to come get, by, which uh, is what we were basically surviving. Uh, with. That is where you're getting the funds to yeah. plant here. Yes. All right. Yes. So it was a little bit harder to get the funds to invest on this other side. Yes. Yes. All right. Uh, but what are some of the things you have learned uh, from the seven months mm -hmm. that we have had the, the, the pandemic as well? What mm -hmm. are some of the, uh, the, 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 the major things you have left the pandemic with mm -hmm. in terms of lessons? I think the first thing is how you utilize your time. Mm -hmm. Now during quarantine, I think a lot of people had time on time on their hands. So for me, I also learned how to do 3D modeling. I've started to do that in order to also increase the value that I add to to the company. Uh, so I've also learned in terms of patience. Mm -hmm. You know, things don't just happen mm -hmm. when you want them to happen. Uh -huh. um, the third thing I learned is about not giving up because mm -hmm. you you see in a position where we are struggling to get small opportunities, uh -huh. and here we are trying to launch this big uh -huh. thing that uh -huh. we don't the idea have. It's big. It's big. You're looking you know. for small opportunities to grow it. Uh -huh. Yeah. So I think I think also learning how to not 
look at your situation in terms of I can't go for this bigger thing because of where I'm at right now or because of what is happening mm -hmm. around me. So I've really learned to just take the risk if you believe in what you are doing because shuffle land for us was a risk and I think I learned that even if uh, the situation around you doesn't uh, feed, feed, fit into your dreams or fit into what you would like, mm -hmm. still go ahead and be bold with, still with what you're doing. Yeah. I'd like to talk about the last uh, button that I'm clicking here today. We have the Shuffle Learn Store. Yes. What is the idea behind this? And I see somebody with a card right there. Mm -hmm. What is this shop about? This is a school with a shop. Mm -hmm. Tell me, tell me this idea. It's it's kind of genius too. Uh, so that is because, uh, so personally, we care about our topic creators and we would like them to be able to earn money from okay. from being a topic creator on Shuffle So the thing with the Shuffle store, uh, so that's just the short form SL, SL store. So we want to, once we, so currently we've set a goal of 5,000 topic creators. So once we reach that number, we can have enough people to kickstart the store. So if I'm a topic creator and I focus on photography, uh -huh. and I have an so ebook or I have yes pictures calendars yes calendars you can now sell what you are doing uh -huh. on on the shuffle and store and earn, right, earn some right. money from being a topic creator uh, on the website so that is also in terms of the product adding value to mm -hmm. to people so that is something that is really key mm -hmm. and I think it would be a really good uh, in terms of the business model of the product as well, it works for us and it works for it's the way to make money topic and creator. Also, uh, puts the money in the pockets of the topic creators right there. Yes, yes. All right, wonderful. This is an amazing idea right here, yeah. and I love the site. We also have the dark and the and the and the the dark mode and the light mode. Yes. All right. Uh, what what is why is this so important? Because I see it. Uh, I think on the first page that I clicked right here. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. Uh, so I think right now where technology and apps and websites are, mm -hmm. if you find a website that doesn't give you the dark mode option, yeah. it seems like it's not in the current in the current, in the current time like it's left behind. In the dark. Yes, mm -hmm. yes, night. yes, uh -huh. yes. Personally, I think for major websites, I use dark mode personally, uh -huh. like it. Uh -huh. So I, I thought in terms of giving the product a lot of relevance uh -huh. in the online world, in the uh -huh. innovative world. Uh -huh. So something as simple as giving a user the options for light mode and dark mode mm -hmm. would give shuffle on an image of a product that is aware of the time all zone right, right. that it and is that in. edge right there. Yes. I can use it in the outdoors, palivo, light mode, yeah. and as I tumia kwa nyumba, dark mode, yeah. and whatnot. All right, I like, I like yeah. right there. Yeah. Okay, so as we wrap up, please give them your social media handles, mm -hmm. uh, but before you give them your social media handles, mm -hmm. as a self-taught coder, mm -hmm. uh, what is the... What is the importance of having uh, information online? Mm -hmm. Like this information that you're trying to provide to the photographers and the content creators for well-being. What is that importance of being able to Google something that you're looking for and find it, either mm -hmm. on Shuffleland or Code Academy mm -hmm. or whatever site? Mm -hmm. uh, what is that importance? I think uh, the importance is uh, implementation. I think it's not just about what you learn online, it's about how you implement it. Mm -hmm. So I think in terms of the information that is out there, there's a lot of information. There's a lot of information and I think what differentiates the people who consume it or the people who truly benefit from it mm -hmm. are the people who learn how to implement it. Mm -hmm. So I think implementation is very important right. in terms there of, of what of you're learning. But always remember how how are you going to implement it? Yes, yes, mm -hmm. yes. That is the most important question you should ask yourself. Yes, yes. Social media handles and uh, tell investors to come uh, rock with you guys. Um, okay, so on camera three. Yeah, four. camera four. Oh, okay. Uh, my social media handle is uh, Tony Mumo. I have a page uh, for our company. It's Mark Me uh, on Facebook. On Instagram, it's Mark Me IG. Mm -hmm. uh, you can find us on those uh, platforms on Facebook and Mark Me, and you can talk to us. You can see what you are doing. You can join Shuffle and if you are interested. Mm -hmm. And if you'd like to invest in in us, I would like to have you. And Shuffle is a product that also has. 
a global potential. We've marketed it uh, online in India, in on in Egypt, Ethiopia, and we've gotten a lot of positive feedback. So it's a product that has global relevance as well, and we'd like to have someone who shares that vision with us. Thank you very much, Mr. Tony, yeah. and all the best at Matmi, all yeah. the best at Shuffle, and keep doing what you're doing. Yes. We appreciate you so much. Thank you. All right, we have come to the end of our first interview of the day on this particular Queen's Wednesday as we celebrate the Queen's. Remember, we are on Facebook at Y254, Twitter at Y254 channel, and we have a question about breakups right there. So check it out. I will be sampling them towards the end of the show, but right up next, we are having a conversation on the same. So don't go nowhere. Don't take that down.